Alice. 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 <laughs> yeah. Are you familiar with Occam's razor? Um, all things being equal, a simple solution is the best solution. That's right. Now, what that principle tells me is that the only person known to have been at your parents' house this morning, it was you. I don't see how it's possible to arrive at that conclusion. Well, there was no evidence of an intruder. But absence of evidence isn't evidence of absence. I know I'm making a leap. It's a, it's a little leap. It's more of a hop. Is this where you asked me if I hated my parents? It's about that time, yeah. Did they make me a freak? Yeah. Do I hate them? Absolutely. But did I kill them? No. Then prove it. I can't prove a negative, it can't be done. Innocence is a negative, it's an absence of guilt. Meaning that the burden of proof is entirely yours. If you want to say that I did this, then you need to demonstrate how and when. I don't know. And I won't be able to find out, will I? Oh, well you could certainly try. Because there is nothing. <laughs> you don't interact with the things we know in the way that we expect. Your presence, your absence, can only be inferred by a certain absence. Is that a compliment? Absolutely. Are you trying to beguile me? No, I wouldn't be that foolish. But I will tell you this, Alice. You can revel all you like in your brilliance, but people slip up. Happens all the time. Well, that's just faulty logic postulated on an imperfect data collection. What if you only catch the people that make mistakes? That would, that would skew the figures, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. But Criminals aren't always as smart as they think they are. Well, that must get so monotonous for someone as brilliant as you.